Hello and welcome to your final Lenten midweek message for 2021. I'm Pastor Carlton Larson from the St. John Narana Parish here in Saskatchewan. This year we've decided to do things differently. Everything has been different this year. But for the Lenten readings, we've been setting to music the Passion Narrative from Mark. The Passion Narrative from Mark is fascinating for so many reasons, but one of the uh, challenges when you're dealing with Mark's Passion Narrative is that there are at least three endings. At the end of Mark, the oldest version we have ends with the women running from the tomb and not telling anybody. And that's the end. They find the tomb empty and they're confused and they're frightened and they're almost, they're almost panicking and they run from the tomb. The simple short story in Mark is so human and so intimate and it's so true to the way we react to the unfamiliar with fear much of the time. The amazing thing is these people who were so frightened, who were so overwhelmed, became the evangelists. And Mary Magdalene, the first evangelist, the one who evangelized the disciples, is the most amazing and fascinating character of all. She is the one who proclaims, I have seen the Lord. And the others, they don't know what to do, but they know that they're afraid to believe her words. We have the witness of these amazing, faithful, courageous women who stick with Jesus to the end, to the cross and beyond, and they go to the grave. And it is them who find the body missing and report this. And in Mark's shorter ending, that's not the very shortest, it is she who finds the words of Christ coming to her. And it is she who is the apostle of apostles, the apostle to the apostles. So we remember Mary, Mary Magdalene, who has been so maligned through history and who has been declared a saint in not only the Catholic tradition, but in our Lutheran tradition as well. And there are so many stories about Mary Magdalene. So we honor her by telling her version of the story and by recounting Mark's account this year. Thank you for being with us on this journey and for listening to all of these recordings and being part of our service and are part of our worship together. May God bless us as we exit the Lenten journey and enter the joy of Easter. <laughs>